welcome to the Mitsunobu reaction so here we have to be familiar we should have to be familiar with some terms like what is dead what is dead dead the full form of dead is diethyl diethyl azo di carboxylate okay so this d for this d this e for this e this a for this a and this d is for mm, di, this d so diethyl azo dicarboxylate this is the full form of date and uh, this is tri triphenyl phosphyl okay so that's all so next we'll move on to the mechanism of the mitsunobu reaction let's do the mechanism of mitsunobu reaction so for mitsunobu reaction we have this very important compound called dead in our hand okay and there is triphenyl phosphine so this triphenyl phosphine will attack this electrophilic nitrogen and this negative charge developing here would be stabilized in this carbonyl group to give this M M C O two D over here or this positively charged phosph phosphorus and now here like we can represent it like this now what will occur next we have uh, alcohols alcohols here and this lone pair is there so it can attack over there okay at the same same time we can show it in different steps also but at the same time or after this or before this there are weak nucleophiles like hnu this is proton and by pushing this lone pair it can abstract proton from here to keep this nu minus and when this is forming here like co2 et p53 and oh r is plus and here over nh co2 et this okay now uh, this proton can be again deprotonated this proton can be deprotonated by another molecule another molecule of this like any negative source can negative ion source can be deproton can deprotonate this so we can represent it like uh, uh, this one this uh, any of the nitrogen end okay any of the nitrogen end can deprotonate this by pushing this lone pair this with this can deprotonate this okay by pushing this negative charge here it can deprotonate this to keep this one CO2 ET PBH3 O this R and now this this one okay to keep this here we deliberately write this one as like this here we can put this and this okay here we are not putting anything because 
we will see it later it can represent this one also and another one thin also okay so we are not writing anything here so now uh, next thing what will happen we can the uh, what is the mechanism that the nucleophile nu minus which, which is generated here this can now attack in SN2 fashion to here okay and then this bond will go like this okay and now this can go to this to give this one N minus CO2 T here NH CO2 T okay and the product is forming here and the product is forming here is R NU this is this is the product which is forming and what this this can stabilize in this here in this resonance form like in, in sorry OET H CO2 T now what will be the fate of this anion so as we are showing here this okay this proton dip proton deprotonation step this can be done by this molecule so this may be this molecule or this molecule or this molecule and this can also act act as doing this deprotonation this deprotonation also so when reaction starts which negative mm, negatively charged species is doing which deprotonation we can't say so all the negative the charge species can do that thing thing so finally what is sure that this will be end up like co 2 t h and here over co 2 t h so this is the whole mechanism this is the whole mechanism of the mitsunobu reaction as you can see this one so this is the steps involved in this reaction this is the steps involved in this reaction to get this product so the key step here is the attack of this phosphine over this which is possible because of this electrophilic end of this nitrogen due to the pool of this co2 et group and next attack is this and this crucial most crucial attack is over here okay where this in this step we are generating this phosphine oxide phosphine oxide which is very important so this strong PO bond formation energy is the driving force for this reaction which we we have seen in Wittig reaction also so this is the mechanism of the Mitsunobu reaction hope you enjoyed the video uh, if you have any question regarding this Mitsunobu reaction, please write in the comment section. We will enjoy your comments.